Hi everybody, welcome back to another Takedown Tuesday. Uh, this week we didn't have a lot going on. We were just preparing for our trip down to Jacksonville, Florida, where again we'll see Wisconsin, Buffalo, and L Little Rock. You can watch that on Rockfin. Don't forget our, about our first home duel. We have Iowa here at home on December 10th. Don't forget to get your tickets on GoMox.com. Our four captains have been announced and we're gonna let them introduce themselves and answer a few questions. My name's Logan Andrew from Winter Park, Florida. I wrestled at Lake Highland Prep in Orlando and I'm wrestling heavyweight this year. Uh, I'm most excited just to wrestle this season. Uh, I missed last year from an ACL injury and this team's ready this year. We're ready to scrap, ready to get in the fight. I chose Chattanooga because it's, it's an awesome city and good school and good coaches and a fun team. You know, every one of this team's brothers. Good leader I look up to in wrestling. It's definitely, you know, Kyle Rochelle, Kyle Massey, Hunter Gamble. They're all great leaders. Sean Russell, all great leaders in wrestling. And uh, I'll say, I would say outside of wrestling, got to say my dad. And then definitely uh, high school coach Mike Palazzo. I can't just pick one leader, you know, I got a lot of awesome leaders in my life. Um, I'm Rocky Jordan. I'm from St. Paris, Ohio, and I'm wrestling 174 this year. You know, I'm really excited about this team. You know, I haven't seen this team compete yet, but I'm really excited to see how they compete. I've been training hard with them the last few months. I've only been here for a few months, but uh, really excited to see how they compete and how they uh, show what we've been working on this year. Initially, I knew Coach Rochelle a little bit. He knows my family. He coached my cousins in Wisconsin, and uh, so that kind of had an end when I was transferring from uh, Ohio State there. But uh, once I got here, I came on a visit. I just I fell in love with the city. I fell in love with the team, and really like all the coaches. And just you know, everyone gets along really well. And I, I feel like it's a place I would really enjoy being, and I could succeed and achieve some goals. Um, a good leader I look up to is I'd probably say my dad. Uh, he he taught me a lot of what I know in wrestling. He was my coach in high school, and. Uh, yeah, he, he was a great leader and he just, he taught me everything I know today. My name is Noah Castillo, I'm from Orlando, Florida, and I'm wrestling 149 pounds. Uh, this season I'm excited for wreaking all the benefits of all the work we put in. Just getting a lot of wins and winning the SOCON, getting more All-Americans and individually winning an all, getting All-American this year. Chattanooga just has so much history in the sport and they have so much history of winning and I wanted to come here and hopefully be a part of a change and bring the winning back and I just love the city and all the fans. Uh, a good leader I look up to is definitely my dad. He's always humble and resilient and just is always hardworking. And definitely throughout my years of living, I've learned like what he said and taken into my own life. So definitely him being vocal and not being afraid to stand out and say what's wrong and what's right. And just doing exactly what you say and not being a fraud. My name is Weston Wickman. I'm from Johnson Creek, Wisconsin. I'll be wrestling 165 this year. I'm most excited to compete with the guys, everything like that. Southern Scuffle, and then obviously end of the year excites me. But I'm really excited for this team to like really take off this year and show who we are. Uh, I chose Chattanooga Wrestling because of the coaches. Um, I believe this program could build up, and that's exactly what we're doing right now is we're about to build up and show everyone. Uh, leaders I look up to are my coaches. Um, obviously, I think. They should, those should be inspirational people to you, um, someone that can lead you into battle. And then um, Ben Askren has been another big influence in my life, so I definitely look up to him as well. Uh, values I see in a leader are just putting the work in. Um, a lot of people talk about being a champion and wanting to work to be a champion and everything like that. But the people that are putting the work in are the people that I look up to the most. Um, that's, that's what I follow. I don't necessarily follow words.